At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Lee Dixon. And we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It's Arsenal versus Manchester United. Hi, Derek. Well, I'm biased because I'm English through and through. What a special place for a cup final this is. I absolutely love this place. And those players are in for a real treat. What a chance to put your name up in lights. Really looking forward to this, I really am. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Bernd Leno begins in goal. Thomas Barze starts with Granit Xhaka in the centre of the pitch and getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Alexandre Lacazette. Potentially one to savour. Arsenal get this game underway. Gabriel Martinelli. Thomas now. Hector Bellerin. The ball with David Luiz. Granit Xhaka. Tierney. Well, attacking possibilities. Advantage, Arsenal. Referees are rightly praised for giving advantage, but when there is no advantage, it has to be a free kick. Well, now he's walking on eggshells, you might say. Next time it'll be yellow. Gabriel Martinelli. Jacker with it. Tierney. Not a great pass. Mason Greenwood. Edinson Cavani now. Can they take advantage? Well, the attack carried promise, but petered out. Promising sequence. And he read it well defensively. Perfectly positioned to take it away. And tidily played. United finding space on the wing. Bruno Fernandes. Fred. Went in strongly to win the ball. And attempting the through ball. Might be able to get in behind the defence. And cleared away. So the corner played into the box. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Good pressure high up the pitch. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Greenwood over the touchline for a throw in Tierney Martin Odegaard now Lacazette Gabriel Martinelli and snuffing out the danger has plenty of know-how in the ball shielding department. Rashford. And return to Cavani. Takes it on. Incredible instinctive goalkeeping. Yeah, he didn't have long to react, did he? But you have to praise his reflexes there. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Martin Odegaard Martinelli it's with Odegaard and taken away he won the ball oh big chance Cavani Rashford 
Well, the shot from that position left a bit to be desired. you just got to hit the target. Let the power down a little bit and go for accuracy. Thomas. Lacazette. Granit Xhaka. They do pass the ball with authority. Retaining possession proving difficult. Cavani. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Martin Odegaard. Good idea, that particular move, but not to be. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Fred. Scott McTominay. On to Juan Bissaka. It's with McTominay. Fred. Good pass. So after that, a goal kick it'll be. Well, as you can see from the possession, there's little between these two teams. It's been a real tight, cagey affair. You just hope it opens up a little that one of these teams is willing to take a few risks. Martin Odegaard. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Tierney. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. And he keeps going. Can he put them in front? And the keeper acquitted himself well. Yeah, it was a good ball in, wasn't it? But the keeper did everything right. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Fred. Bruno Fernandes. It's with McTominay. An alert intervention. Cavani. United might be able to cash in. Crossing possibilities. Pumped clear. Oh, what's he gone and done? Defensive efficiency personified. Lacazette, Bukayo Saka, Partey, Jacka with it. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Scott McTominay, Greenwood. Well, there might well be scope for them to counter attack here. Defenders need to cover. And United will switch things around personnel wise. Juan Bisaka and players waiting in the center. McTominay. Here's Cavani. Thomas. Martin Odegaard. They're on the scent of a winner late in this game. United have it once again. Only 10 minutes remaining here. Scott McTominay. It's a fine United move in the making. That's an effective cross aimed at the back post. Very clear who got the last touch. So a corner coming up. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. He's driven in the corner. My goodness, with the game level, you've got to be more opportunistic than that. Well, no composure. It must be nerves. What a chance to finish it off. 
Oh, that's an interesting pass. Well, getting a strong fist on the ball. Arsenal's corner late in the game. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Played into the centre of the box. Well, it has come to nothing. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Well, he's given it away. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Fred. Matic on the ball. That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and... And so the story continues. The first period of extra time, and no one is leaving. Well, fitness levels are going to be tested now, Derek. Matic couldn't protect the ball. Bayerin. Chance to cross. Can they keep it out? Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Chance to run at them. Cavani might fancy it. The header, but far too straight to worry the keeper. Yeah, meat and drink for a goalkeeper of that class. When you look at those stats, Derek, it tells a story all of its own. They haven't created enough chances. The forwards have been off the game as well. They haven't really utilised the wide areas for me, but they should go on and win the game, to be honest. Bruno Fernandes. Cavani. Chances on. Sends it back. Time in extra time. Substitution for Manchester United coming off the well, pitch. Well, extra time continues. We're into the second period now. Coming onto the pitch. The possession lost, intercepted. Martial. Juan Bisaka. And he's made headway. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. Playing with purpose and control. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal so kicked the outcome. Coming off the pitch. Time for a change then. Onto the pitch, number 17, Seth. Died the final five minutes of extra time, and a penalty shootout might well be in this game's future. Arsenal remain on the front foot. Can they find a winning goal? From the bake. Well, great read there to intercept. It's a good-looking ball in behind, and victory beckons! A colossal goal, and could it be the goal that will give them the trophy? Well, all they've got to do now, Derek, is not concede, and the cup is theirs. Easier said than done, though. Well, here's the replay, and what a ball that is to put him through. And he had choices of what type of finish to apply, and bang, he goes for the smash. Lovely goal. Well, the manager knows the importance of that goal. He also knows that you're at your most vulnerable just after you've scored.
And the final whistle, the cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. And Lee, memories are being made. Yeah, absolutely. It doesn't matter how much money you've got in the bank. Players will always look back at moments like these. These moments where you pick trophies up and win medals. Absolutely brilliant for this group of players. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, it's these moments, Derek, when you get your hands on the silverware and that little medal that goes round your neck might seem small now, but you look back at that, show your grandkids absolutely superb memories these players will have of this game. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Yeah, it's been a long old road to get to this point. They're going to celebrate now and certainly celebrate long into the night, I think. There's always the element of charm taking the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. And this is really special, getting to celebrate in front of your own fans, Lee. Well, it's giving something back. These fans have travelled all over the place following their team. Now they get to join in the celebrations go into the crowd and give them the cup, that's what I say. Well, then it might never find its way to the trophy cabinet, Lee. Well, all that hard work along the way in this tournament all comes together at the end when you pick the trophy up. Just look at them celebrating, a brilliant moment. Hard work indeed, Lee. The trophy now in their possession. Potentially...